I'll tell you, inflation has a lot of people looking to save money these days. Mm -hmm. And when you find a deal, you're likely to act quickly. But what if the store decides to rescind that deal? That's when NBC10 Responds goes to work for you. These are the chairs I fought so hard for. Keith Ellsbury has been on a mission to find specific chairs for his kitchen. My brother have a similar chair, and I like them because uh, I was trying to downsize my kitchen. He found them at Urban Furniture Outlet in Newcastle. I wanted these chairs. And on sale. Two foot, $269. It was slashed. It was, the original price was 400 Keith signed the contract with 169 down, 100 at pickup. But then he says the manager of the store reached out. The three hours later, he called and said, that's the wrong price of the chairs. I said, well, that's not my problem, sir. I signed the contract. He visited the store the next day to share his contract that clearly shows two chairs and the price. And I said, sir, it's right there on your kiosk screen, the price on sale for two chairs for 269 You say, I don't care. It was the wrong price. It was a mistake. Keith says the manager promised his deposit would be refunded. But that wasn't the issue. The issue was I wanted that chair, you know, for that price. That's when he went online and filed a complaint with NBC10 Responds. And I remember seeing articles on NBC News. I said, well, you know what? I'm going to give it a shot. We contacted Urban Furniture. The owner told us the salesperson helping Keith was new. And the correct price should have been $269 per chair. Bottom line, he would not honor the sale. But later that day, Keith says he got a call from the owner. He would get his chairs at the sale price. I just paid the 269 I went over and picked the chairs up a day later. NBC10 Responds reached back out to the owner and visited the store after Keith got his chairs to find out why the owner changed his mind. We were told they had no further comment. But Keith does. I got the chairs. NBC helped me get the chairs. Now, if you ever find a good deal on something... Do what Keith did, document it. He took a picture of the kiosk that showed the offer, and he saved his contract that detailed the sale. That way, if something goes wrong, you'll have documentation that you can share with your state's Consumer Protection Office, the Better Business Bureau, or with NBC10 Responds. NBC10 Responds has now recovered more than $1.8 million in money, goods, and services for our viewers. Jackie?